Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In today's video, we have one very, very interesting question from exponential equations. It is 27 power log x minus 1 minus x raised to the power log 3 equal to 2. And we are going to find out real solutions only. So let's get started this video by writing one powerful exponential property a power b minus c, which we can write a power b divided by a power c. Let's apply this property here. So I can write our LHS as 27 power log x divided by 27 minus x power log 3 equal to 2. Now I will multiply both sides by 27. So I will write here 27. I will write here 27. Let's expand LHS. It will give us 27 power log x minus 27 times x raised to the power log 3. RHS is 54. Now I will consider this 27 as 3 cube. So I will be writing 3 cube log x minus 27 times x raised to the power log 3 RHS 54. Now I will swap these two powers using property of exponents which states that a power b whole power c it will be equal to a power c whole power b. So I will be writing our equation as 3 power log x whole cube minus 27 times x power log 3 equal to 54. Now another log property I will write this time a power log b equal to b power log a. Let us apply this property here. So I can write x power log 3. And then we have whole cube minus 27 times x power log 3 equal to 54. Now you can see x power log 3, x power log 3. So let us consider x power log 3 equal to y and condition on y would be y should be greater than 0. So let's apply our substitution. It will be y cube minus 27y equal to 54. So y cube minus 27y equal to 54. Or I can write y cube minus 27y minus 54 equal to 0. Now this is one cubic equation. I will use method of factorization. So let me split minus 27 as minus 36y plus 9y. This is minus 27y overall. Minus 54 equal to 0. From first two terms we can see y is common. So y square minus 36. From last two terms 9 is common. And we'll get y minus 6 in bracket. Now it is y square minus 6 square. So we can apply the difference of two squares identity and we can write y plus 6 times y minus 6 plus 9 times y minus 6 equal to 0. Now y minus 6 is common. So we can write in bracket y times y plus 6 plus 9 and right hand side is 0 or I can write y minus 6 times y square plus 6y plus 9 and RHS 0. So conclusion from here is either y minus 6 equal to 0 or y square 
प्लस सिक्स वाई प्लस नाइन इक्वल टू जीरो सो फ्रॉम दिस फर्स्ट इक्वेशन वी कैन कंक्लूड वाई इक्वल टू सिक्स वाई इज पॉजिटिव एंड रियल नाउ फ्रॉम सेकेंड इक्वेशन वी कैन कंक्लूड इट इज वन होल स्क्वायर और परफेक्ट स्क्वायर सो आई विल बी राइटिंग इट इज होल स्क्वायर ऑफ वाई प्लस थ्री आर एच एस जीरो सो कंक्लूजन फ्रॉम हेयर इज वाई इज इक्वल टू नेगेटिव थ्री एंड नेगेटिव थ्री बोथ वैल्यूज आर नेगेटिव एंड कंडीशन ऑन वाई वॉज वाई शुड बी पॉजिटिव फॉर रियल सोल्यूशन सो वी विल रिजेक्ट बोथ द सोल्यूशन फ्रॉम दिस क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन so y is equal to 6 will be our accepted value or solution what was y y was our substitution x raised to the power log 3 let me write here y equal to x raised to the power log 3 equal to 6 now i will consider log both sides so i will be writing log x raised to the power log 3 equal to log 6 now i will write property from log log a power b it will be equal to b log a so i will consider this power log 3 as a multiplier here so log 3 times log x Equal to log six, or I can write log x equal to log six over log three, or we can write it is equal to log six with base three. This is the value of log x. So from here I can write x equal to ten raised to the power log six. With base three, this is our final answer. Let me write here. X is equal to ten raised to the power log six with base three. Now I can use property of exponent or log. It is I can write six raised to the power log ten with base three, or we can write six raised to the power One over log three. So we have three different forms of our answer. Now let us verify our result. So I will be writing here verification. Now I will write our equation in this form first. Twenty-seven power log x divided by twenty-seven and x power log three. I am writing three power log x. This is our LHS. Now further, I can write twenty-seven. So I can write here three power log x, and then whole cube using exponent property divided by twenty-seven is three cube minus three power log x. Now I will consider log x result which we calculated in the last slide. So log x will be equal to log 6 with base 3 i will apply direct value so 3 power log x so i will be writing 3 power log 6 with base 3 and this value will be 6 only so here we have to write 6 cube over 27 minus 6 this is our lhs let me write here 6 cube over 27 minus 6 denominator 27 i can write 6 cube over 3 cube minus 6 or we can write 6 over 3 whole cube minus 6 6 over 3 is 2 whole cube minus 6 it is 8 minus 6 it will be 2 And two is our RHS. Hence, our result is true and verified. So, our final solution it would be x is equal to ten raised to the power 
log 6 with base 3. And this is the end of the video friends. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. And bye bye.